Hey y'all, it's me, Siren on the Dragon. If you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, and share the video. So let's get into it for our Capricorns. Let's see what's coming in here for you. First, let's do our sound clearing. So we got obsession, cuffing season, and stuck in the past. Purified energy. Sexual fantasies in the grass of space. Okay, so obsession, cuff and season, obsession, stuck in the past, purify, the grass was fake, and sexual fantasies, okay? So for the Capricorn, I'm seeing that there could be somebody who's either obsessed with your relationship or there's somebody who you were in a relationship with who from your past who's obsessed over you. But I feel like you purified your energy of this person because you knew that the relationship was fake and it was based only off of sex. Okay. <clears throat> so let's see. For the Capricorns here. For the Capricorn, what's obsession for the Capricorn? Obsession. So yeah, we got partnership here. So there's a, either a couple is obsessed with you or somebody, one of these, somebody who you were in a, yeah, somebody who you were working with, a lover who you were working with from your past is obsessed with you. Okay, somebody is obsessed with you. Yeah, Knight of Wands. They're obsessed with, um, you know, having sex with you. They want to have sex with you. They, they, that's what the relationship was grounded in. Y'all had like a sexual commitment. And so now it's like you pull back your energy and they're at a two of pinnacles trying to figure out why you no longer want to work with them. They're stressed out because you're no longer, you're choosing not to work with them anymore. With the three of, um, three of swords, they could really be heartbroken. This person could have actually been in love with you based off of your sex. So what's this um, cuffing season here for the Capricorn? Um, cuffing season with the Capricorn. So Ten of Wands, something, something is weighing very heavy on you. This relationship was weighing very heavy on you. And I feel like you, you chose to move forward. You chose to move forward with the Eight of Wands and the Six of uh, Swords. You just wanted to move forward. You didn't want to deal with it anymore, okay? And this person with the Four of Pentacles is trying to hold on to you, even though you've ghosted this person. Yeah, you ghosted this person because this person was very dark, very dark, very sinister, okay? This could have been a baby mother situation as well. Um, let's see. What the queen? I saw the Queen of Cups. That's why I said that. So let's see. What's this um, stuck in the past? Or this person is very much in an emotional, in their in, in their emotions about you. So stuck in the past, um, we have the hermit and the two of two of wands. So yeah, this person from your past, you ghosted them. You made a decision to ghost them because they could have been casting a lot of illusions over you with magic with the queen of wands. They could have been um, doing mental manipulation over you to try or emotional manipulation to try and keep you stuck and keep you in a sad energy to keep you feeling like you know nobody would love them other than you. 
with the um yeah yeah but i feel like you moved on you showed you got victory and success here because you chose to move forward from this situation with the nine of pentacles on the, on the bottom you got you you're single now and so you're victorious now that you've moved forward you're just saying you you closed your back or you turned your back on working with this person um and, and partner up for the sex or whatever because this person could have put you in a third party situation and could have been having sex with more than they could have been having sex with more than one person including you like they could have been having sex with somebody else like outside of you and outside of the other person who they were having sex with they could have been having a lot of people having sex with them okay so yeah so somebody just somebody's karma is being rejected here with this karma card this judgment somebody made a judgment call to reject this person with the four of cups and that's that's karma they, you purified your energy let's purify your energy here purify your energy is, the, is clarified by the four of swords you you put something to rest and nine of pentacles again you laid it to rest and now you're single not um this this yeah now you're single yeah, because this situation was a codependent situation with the Six of Pentacles in reverse. This is somebody who was just um, coming to you just for you to take care of them. Yeah, and now justice is being served here on your behalf with the purified energy. Yeah, you're able to purify your energy now. Okay, Six of Pentacles in reverse, Nine of Pentacles, Four of Swords. You can do it. You're, you, you chose to get on, move, move away. You sailed in your boat and got on. You released this energy, okay? So, um, what is the grassless faith? The grassless faith here, what was that? The grassless faith. That's too many cards. What's the grassless faith? Five of Swords, King of Wands, King of Wands, and then we got the Queen of Swords for the Grassless Fate. Okay, and then we got Five of Wands on the bottom of the deck. So we're gonna clarify this. What is the Queen of Swords here for the Grassless Fate? Okay, Queen of Swords. So you walked away from this Queen of Swords because they were always um, in like drama, in a drama, a dramatic energy. They always wanted to have drama. So you sailed away from this person. There was always a lot of chaos and confusion around this person. Always a lot of conflict. And so you 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 decided, you know, you wanted to go down the, the, the road less traveled. But I also see that somebody was trying to send you chaos magic here. They were sending chaos magic to um, this empress. Somebody trying to send chaos magic to this empress. And um, yeah, this queen of wands, this person who um, you were, who you're deciding to move on from, this high priestess. Yeah, you decide to move on from this person. Yeah. Four of cups, you 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 um, could have rejected this person or you wanted this person to, re you wanted this king of pentacles to reject the empress or something like that. This queen of wands wanted the king of pentacles to reject the empress. This queen of wands is also the king of, the, the, the queen of swords. This queen of swords is given like a very much bitter energy here. They wanted you to, um, they were trying to, it's almost like they were trying to be that person who they knew that you wanted to go towards or something like that here. So what's this five of swords energy? They were, yeah, they put themselves in competition with this person. Five of swords. They were copying this person. They were doing whatever they saw this person do. With the page of cups and the stars. So they, if this person was like making money or had a, um, they were like had a lot of they were had a very healing energy they love kids or they were highly intuitive this person yeah they were highly intuitive with the high priestess here they began to um, put themselves in competition with this person and pretend to be a high priestess as well they pretended to get um for for of uh, they pretended to get intuitive advice as well but really they you know you know they they weren't they weren't getting intuitive advice. They were kind of like, yeah, they were, that's the truth. 
They weren't getting intuitive advice. They were sneaking and lying. They weren't in getting anybody. They weren't getting intuitive advice. They were copying other people who they saw. They were watching other people online and choosing to use their work. Okay, so that was that was where that fake energy is coming in here, Capricorn. So, um, yeah, somebody was just studying other people's work and then um, copying them, mimicking them. So what's this sexual fantasies here for the Capricorn? Sexual fantasies here for the Capricorn. Sexual fantasies here for the Capricorn. So, um, yeah, somebody was keeping up a lot of illusions, but it all came down. Somebody's angry because they're they can't they can no longer do mental the the magic that they were doing on you, Capricorn. It was it was sex magic, okay? With the sexual fantasies, it was sex magic. This is the magic card you know illusions they were casting illusions over you through sex and now they're angry because they can no longer do that with the um will of fortune coming out here the cycle is complete karma has now you know turned around now the will has turned that was 11 11 on the uh time stamp when i said that so yeah all right capricorn that is what i have for you yes 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 that is what i have for you